Welcome everyone to my channel. Today we have an exponential equation. How do we solve this kind of exponential equation? Very easy. Let's take down our equation. But before we do that, this is Online Mouse TV and my name is Jakes Anemo. If you're new here, kindly subscribe. The reason why you have to subscribe is because we drop new mathematical challenges here every time for your learning. Okay, so let's go to the board and see how we handle this kind of challenge. The question is 5 to the power of x plus 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 5 to the power of x equal to 2. What would be the possible value of x here? So take our solution. So her solution. Four. Let's pull down our question, which is 5 to the power of x plus 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 5 to the power of x equal to 2. The first thing we do here is to factor out 5 to the power of x. And so if we do that, we're going to have this 5 to the power of x bracket 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus bracket. Everything equal to 2. This will give us 5. So we have 5 to the power of x dot 5 equal to 2. So from here, here we have a numerator that is not raised to any variable. So we divide through by this 5. So if we divide through by 5, we're going to have this all over 5, this all over 5. This and this will leave the system. And so we're left with 5 to the power of x equal to 2 all over 5. Okay, so from here, what we do? We take log to be 10 on both sides of the equation. Okay, so if we do that, we're going to have here log 5 to the power of x this 10 equal to the log of 2 all over 5 or to base 10. Okay, so from here, let's continue on this side and see what this gives us in turn. Okay, now if you look at this, here yeah, we apply the law of log reading. Okay, so the law says that if you have your log um, m to the power of k base a, move this power backward. So if you move this backward, we're going to have your k log the uh, m base a. So if we apply this law, we're going to have this left hand side. So moving the whole of this backward. Okay. So this will now give us here x into log of 5 base 10 equal to here. Let's leave this side first. So we'll have log. 2 all over 5 base 10. Yeah. Now, this again, we apply the uh, division law of logarithm, which says that if you have log m all over n base a, this is equal to log your m base a minus log n base a. So, if we apply this division law of logarithm to this side, so we're going to have our x into log 5 base 10 equal to log 2 base 5 minus log 5 base 10. Very easy. Now we are looking for x. So all we need to do is to divide through by log 5 base 10. Okay, so let's erase this. So if we divide through, yeah, let's divide through by log 5 base 10, then every tier by log 5 base 10. Automatically, this we go with this. So on the left hand side, we are left with our x. So we have here x equal to our log 2 base 5 minus log 5 base 10 all over log 5 base 10. Okay, very easy. So this is the value for our S, QED, QED. All right, so you can as well simplify this down using calculator, I've done that. And if you do that, put the numerical value you have into our X here and you sum up everything, then it will give you an approximate value of this expression. All right, 
Now, this is online mass TV. If you learn something good, if you gain some value from this challenge, drop it in the comment section. Or you like what is going on here? Just drop it in the comment section. Okay, by saying thanks, Jake. And at the same time, if you have a better way of solving this, also drop it in the comment section so that we can equally learn from you. This is Online Mass TV, and my name is Jix Anemo. Remember, I love you so much, and every one of us at Online Mass TV love you. Thanks for always being there. Bye for now.